The table gives the annual income for eight families in thousands of dollars. How many standard deviations is family B's income from the mean? And then we want to round to three decimal places as needed. So we need to find the mean and standard deviation. The problem mentions standard deviation and mean. So obviously we have to find those two quantities. In order to do that, we put the numbers into the calculator in stats mode. On clears any old data. Mode decimal point puts us in stats mode. And then we enter each number by pressing M plus after typing the number in. Shift 7 gives us the mean. That comes out to be 49. Shift 9 gives us the standard deviation and that comes out to three decimal places to be 1.773. Now the problem asked us to find the number of standard deviations the income is for family B from the mean. So we're measuring in standard deviations, so the units are standard deviations. How many standard deviations are inside the difference between family B's income and the mean? Well, first of all, if I want to find how far something is from something else, I subtract. Family B's income is 46, the mean is 49, that's a difference of 3. Family B's income is 3 away from the mean. But they also ask us to measure this in standard deviations. How many standard deviations is that? So you look, one standard deviation is 1.773. So to find how many standard deviations away from the mean it is, you simply divide the difference by the standard deviation. And that's the way it'll always be. You find the difference and then you divide by the standard deviation. Well, we've already found the difference to be 3, and we know the standard deviation is 1.773. So we divide, and it comes out to be 1.692. Family B's income is 1.692 standard deviations from the mean. The difference of family B's income from the mean is a little over one and a half standard deviations.